some huge, huge news has just come out of Midjourney, and we can now say goodbye to third-party upscalers, because we can now upscale right inside Discord. Now, if we come over to the Announcements tab here in Midjourney and in Discord, we can see that they've announced two new upscalers today. They have the 2X and the 4X. Now, here's a little bit of information. I'm not going to read this, so you can pause this if you'd like to, but you can now see the 2X and the 4X upscale buttons under any normal V5 or Niji job after upscaling. So it only works with the V5 or Niji. You can even use this on old jobs as well, using the job ID of your old jobs. The upscaler is subtle and tries to keep details as close as possible to the original image. There may be a few glitches. And the 4X upscaler costs roughly three times more than the 2X upscaler as well. Now, please note, both upscalers only work with fast GPU times. They've actually changed that right here. So if we scroll down, it says they are trying to enable the new upscalers on relax mode. So here we are. This is the new announcement, which is pretty cool. So let's go ahead and give this a go. Because this, this could literally mean that we don't need any third-party upscalers, especially if you're like me and trying to create colouring pages. We can now do that just within Discord, just within Midjourney, with no third-party upscalers. Now, here's an image that I have, a colouring page. I created this little fox colouring page, and we're going to use the new upscaler to upscale this. Now, this right here, this prompt was actually created with my colouring page prompt generator, which is just here. If you want to come through and check this out, there will be a link down in the description below. Now, this all looks normal, but if we go ahead and upscale one of these, we're going to see some new changes. So out of all of these, I quite like number one and number four. So let's just go with number four. So we're going to upscale like normal. And now once this has done its thing, we're going to see some new changes. And there we go. That's now upscaled like normal. Looks pretty good. Really nice coloring page. But if we look just here, we now have these two new options. We have upscale by 2x and upscale by 4x. Now, to put this into perspective, when I normally upscale, I actually quite like using Big JPEG. And on Big JPEG, you have quite a few options, but I only ever use the 4x upscaler. But now I can do that right here with Inside Midjourney. So let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to 4x upscale. We're going to give this a second to do its thing because with these new upscalers, they do take a little bit of time. So please keep that in mind as well. But I'm guessing as the weeks go by, this is only going to become faster and better. Now, in the meantime, while that's doing its thing, let's actually download this one and go and run this through Big JPEG. Now, I have this Chrome extension just here. This is a really great Chrome extension called Prompt a Lot. I did do a video all about it, which was this video just here. If you want to check it out, I will link it down in the description below, because this is just a bunch of shortcuts which makes everything quicker. Now, right here, if we click on download, that's now downloaded. We can go over to Big JPEG. Let's just run this in here. We're going to click start and we're going to do a 4x upscale. And there we go. Now, let's go ahead and download this and we're going to open it as well. Now, let's go back over to here as well. This is still doing its thing. It's at 62%. Like I said, this does take its time. So depending on your workflow and how fast you work, this actually might slow you down if you just want to use the Discord server and no third-party upscalers. Now let's go ahead and open this in a new tab, like so. And let's just give this a second to do its thing. And bam, it's done. So now we have the coloring page, which has been upscaled by 4x. Now we can, right here, redo the upscale to a 2x or redo the upscale to the 4x. 
if it doesn't quite look right. Now what we're going to do is download this and we're going to compare with Big JPEG. Now let's just give that a second to do its thing as well. There we go. Now if we click on here and let's open this one as well. There we go. So this side, the right hand side, is upscaled just within mid journey. The left hand side is upscaled within Big JPEG. Now if we click on here, we can see that the image size for the mid journey upscale is 3000 840 by 4992. If we check on the other one as well, it's exactly the same dimensions. So by doing a 4x up in mid journey, it's exactly the same as what I would personally do over in Big JPEG. And if we take a look at these, they both look pretty good because they're both a coloring page and there's not really any detail which I want enhanced. So, this means that when I'm now creating colouring pages, I can just create them completely within Mid Journey and with no need of a third party upscaler. Now, this is brilliant. This means I don't have to pay for one. I do pay for Big JPEG, but it is fairly cheap. But again, now I can do everything from creating the colouring pages and upscaling just here within mid journey so i just wanted to share that i thought this was a pretty huge deal and pretty cool as well now if you want to keep up to date with all of the announcements over here in mid journey then what you want to do is come over to the announcements tab just here and then just keep an eye on it come in here every other day every few days maybe even once a week, and that way you're going to be up to date with all of the announcements and everything which Mid Journey releases. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a like as it really helps out the channel, and if you want to watch more of my content, then click right here and watch this video.